The day I graduated college was actually the, the day I moved to Saranac Lake. The two of us go out and whether it be right in our front yard on Lake Flower or whether it be, you know, 10 miles back in some wilderness area, you know, we're always finding new places to go check out, new things to sniff, new, new, new pictures to take, basically. You feel strong, you feel good, you feel like you've taking on the entire world. A lot of that stuff, it's, it's serenity. It's, it's absolute peace in the soul and the body and the mind. And you reset your biological clock like that. You get out there and paddle a couple miles. And it's, it's all reset, it's all redone. We feel so lucky that we live here and we're able to enjoy this wilderness and the Adirondacks, but it's very accessible for everybody. When I was younger, I'd, we'd be able to go paddle for six, seven hours and be able to cover some real distance. And now when we got out with the family, we're not trying to get anywhere. We're just trying to have them enjoy what they're doing and for us to enjoy spending time with them. And usually when we're canoeing, everybody's pretty happy. I try and get out paddling every day. You know, there's so much around here. There's so many different options. I mean, you can never get bored. <laughs> I can, I can see Dennis settling down. You can only go so long with a cute dog in a nice canoe before you attract somebody who wants to go out with you. You do that long enough and then you end up having kids and then you end up wanting to go canoeing with them and I think then you end up looking like us. Maybe when that happens, our kids will be the ones passing by his family. That's what I picture.